I, I went to the beggar's banquet press reception as an enemy journalist and that was fantastic, I have to say. I spent a large portion of it under a table with Jimmy Miller dodging these pies flying about over the top and hitting everybody in the head. And uh, at one point in time, I was trying to interview Jimmy actually at the same time about the, about the album and talking to him. And suddenly he said, look behind you. And I looked behind me and suddenly I saw Brian Jones' grinning face come down from the table. He had this huge pie in his hand and he was bringing it back to let me have it, right, under the table. And just as he did it, somebody, I don't know who it was because I couldn't see above me, got him. And this pie splattered into his face and he went backwards. But I was, I just missed being pied by Brian Jones at that, that so particular thing. But it was great fun, you know, it was terrific. Nobody had ever done that before at a press launch. That was another thing, you know. There was some kind of whiny report in the Daily Mail or somewhere saying that, uh, what a shame the Rolling Stones have, you know, relapsed to musical humour or something. But it was a bit more kind of revolutionary than that, you know. People didn't behave that way with the press around them. And that's probably why the Daily Mail guy got sniffy. He probably got pied, you know. <laughs> I thought it was great.